Welcome back to this day. Joining me now is the host of How We Met, Cheryl Stritch. Thank you for being here. And along with Cheryl from the show is Annette Berkowitz. So thank you, ladies, for being here this morning. And um, so, Cheryl, we were just talking. I know your mind's kind of scrambled because <laughs> right. she's getting ready to be a grandma again. How exciting. Yeah, it really is. So your daughter, you just got the call that she's going right. to the hospital. Right. She's in labor. She's in labor. Well, <laughs> prayers and blessings thank that you. everything, mama and baby, are healthy <laughs> and, and that you get out there. Yes. And I guess you're going to go soon to go see her. I am. So. Thank you. <laughs> for so wonderful for your family. So, um, so Cheryl, tell me. What is How We Met? What is it about? How We Met is an uh, interview show. I interview couples from Laguna Woods who tell their story about how they met. Um, we were at a brunch. Annette and I were at a brunch, and a bunch of couples were going around the room talking about how they met, and Annette had the cutest story, and that's when I began to think about putting this show together. And um, it's been great. I've been, we're into our... We're into filming our third episode. The second episode with Annette is on right now. Now, ha do, have you ever had any interview background or anything like this, or you just? Good question. No, but I do ask a lot of questions. <laughs> I am pretty naturally inquisitive. I, I am pretty nosy, and I do find out the story. <laughs> she does it in a nice way. Nice yes. Day. Oh, that's wonderful. I love how, the, I, by the way, I love this idea. I actually, this is like the kind of show that I would love to produce someday. I love finding people's stories and getting yeah. into the, especially the love stories. I, right. I, you know, who doesn't, I'm a romantic at heart. You so. just find out so much about somebody by the, the, way they, the way they met. I mean, okay, so Annette met in the Catskills. She is a Catskill couple. <laughs> she met her husband there. Oh, my and gosh. I, I mean, it's such a cute story. And I'm from New York, and I'd never met anybody who had been a Catskill person, so Catskill couple. So it's, it's I don't know, the whole thing is just really sweet for me because I love finding out about people. And I watched a little bit of your show with Bernard and Virginia. Oh, okay. And I thought their first date they had scheduled was the day that JFK was shot. And then they said everything was shutting down, and they're like, well, should we still get together? I don't know. And, right. and I guess they changed their plans and did get together, and then now married for 57 years. Right. I mean, right. just an inc incredible idea, right. an incredible story. What, what is rewarding for you for doing this show? I know you've just started, but... Um, I, I, I think it's really neat to find out about people, to share that with the community, because everybody wants to know people's story. And so it's kind of neat to find out their stories and, and find out who they really were. I mean, Annette shared her pictures, and they're showing right now, but they, she shared her wedding pictures. And they sort of told a story for me. There they are. They sort of told a story for me, um, who they were when they were, when they were kids. Looks so and different. <laughs> <laughs> you look like... 16? 20. Okay. okay. <laughs> That's why you look so beautiful now, too, because uh, you look very youthful, God. right? It's, at that age, it was always like, no, I want to look older, right? right Everybody right, wants to right. be at least yeah. 21, right. but looking back, and then you go, well, it's really nice to have had such a youthful look. <laughs> so, and that when is this the show that's airing now yes, this it month? Is. Yeah. When Cheryl, when does the show air? Oh, the show airs on Mondays at noon and Saturdays at five thirty. Okay, all through the month. Um, and and that, what did you think when you were on the show? I thought number one, I have to tell you, Cheryl made it so comfortable to be there. I have to thank, thank her for that. Um, you know, there was nothing, it was just easy. Um, the story is the story and I love to tell it anyway. So, um, and if anybody wants it, all they have to do is watch <laughs> that, uh, 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 watch it on Wednesdays. And um, we, uh, I think it's a fabulous idea. I, I think the way we met was really interesting, but so many people have met in such interesting ways, I mean, um, that are different, that are the same, but everybody has their own little bit of difference to it. Yeah, their own love story. Right, and it's exactly. always so nice to hear the different stories. And, right. and um, did you learn anything new about your husband when you guys were on the show and telling your different <laughs> versions? All right, well, I will tell you something really funny. I, um, uh, Cheryl had asked for some pictures. I sent her a slew of pictures, practically my whole album. <laughs> and... Um, one picture in the album, she said, I notice that in one of these family pictures, 
you're not in the center as the bride. You're kind of off to the side. So what are you talking about? He never noticed that. <laughs> Her so mother-in-law was in the middle. That's so we the thing went, they do now today, right? <laughs> so we went back to the picture, and Jerry and I looked at it, and we got hysterical <laughs> laughing because smack in the middle is my mother-in-law. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm off to the side. She's right. <laughs> well, she deserved it. She raised those six boys by herself. She's okay. Ah, <laughs> that's yeah. great. And so I, I was curious, by getting to tell your story here with Cheryl, how long had it been since the last time? Is, you said you've told the story many, several times. I mean, had well, it been a long time since you had reminisced about it? or? Well, like Cheryl said, I mentioned it when we were at lunch. You know, people talk about how they met, and um, it's kind of an interesting story, so I do tell it. Is anyone recognizing you from being on the show yet? <laughs> Just friends. <laughs> friends who know me and say, oh, no. yes. Yeah. Oh, that's wonderful. They still have to see it because this is the beginning of the month. They get to see it yes, all through the month. Right, we're just starting. So do you have guests lined up for like several months out? or um, Because I was ex wasn't sure about when these babies were coming, <laughs> I, I only have people lined up for next month. But that's okay because um, I know I, in my mind I have people lined up but not on paper right now. Yeah, yeah. So how do you... Once you go through all the groups of friends you know and their stories, how, well, I guess through the show, maybe people will people contact have, you. People or, have begun to reach out to me. And at the end of the show, we have a actual um, information that if people want to be on the show, how they can reach us. Oh, how nice. Yeah. And some of us who have been on the show know people that Cheryl may not know that have really interesting stories as well. Right. right. Uh, this is so some great stories for sure, and and it, it's such a wonderful thing to spread this love around. I just think it's such a great idea. Thank you guys for being here. Well, thank you so well, much for you. having us. Absolutely. So you can watch How We Met with Cheryl Stritch as she interviews couples from here in the village on Mondays at noon and Saturdays at 5.30 p.m. Or you can always look up the show anytime on Village Television's YouTube channel. So stay with us, we have movie previews, announcements, and weather coming up right after this.